Even if you don't have kids, here is why you should purchase a property in a higher rated school district. Although you may be paying more value-wise on the front end of things to get into that school district, and taxes tend to be higher in those well-off areas. On the resale side of things, when you live in this property and you go to sell that down the line, number one, your value is going to hold much, much better than if you're in a super crappy school district versus being in one of the highly rated school districts that everybody, all parents are going to be looking for. When you have kids, that's something that you most definitely think about, but when you don't have kids, it's not something that's top of mind. But it's important to remember that when you are looking to purchase a house, you wanna to look towards the future as well and what you're gonna be getting out on that property. And when you're in a highly rated school district, not only do those properties tend to sell faster, but you're gonna have more buyers interested because they are desiring to be in that highly rated school district, which in turn will help push the value up Along with that, when the market shifts downward, these areas with the highly rated school districts tend to be the nicer areas and they tend to hold their value more than not good school districts. So keep that in mind if you don't have kids, definitely put that on your radar to actually focus on looking in areas that are good school districts. Tatum Praise checking out, I'll see you on the next one.